Hey guys, what's up? It's QB time, and in today's video, we have a massive unboxing from SpeedCubeShop.com. Alright, so I have some very exciting puzzles in this box to take a look at. So the first one we're going to look at is this new Yushin Blue 4x4. Now I've heard this is actually a pretty nice puzzle and I'm really excited to get it and I'm really excited to be able to play with it. So let's just take a look at this puzzle. Alright, out of the box it looks pretty nice. Um, stickers are good quality, so let's just do some first turns. It's very sandy right out of the box, and it's also pretty smooth. Um, I like the size, it's like a mini Aosu sized uh, puzzle, and it turns pretty nicely. The outer layers are a little bit slow right now, but they're really sandy and really smooth, and I think this puzzle has some great potential. Tensions are pretty nice, and overall I actually really like how this puzzle turns and how it feels. So the next puzzle we have here is the new Shangxiao Aurora Megaminx. And I am really excited for this one because the Shangxiao Megamix is already a pretty decent puzzle and this one's like Florian modded and stuff. And yes, this thing is extremely greasy right out of the box. Um, that's really okay though, all Shangxiao puzzles come like that. Um, it seems a little bit bigger than the other uh, Shangxiao Megamix, which is like this. Actually, they are the same size, but um, yeah, this is actually a decent puzzle, so let's just start turning this one. Oh, and it's really weird. They have little tiny ridges on it. It's I just noticed. Well, it turns really nice. It feels like the original Shangxiao Mega Mix. It's just a little bit slow right now because it's just right out of the box and there's not really a lot of lube on the pieces. Let's just see the reverse cutting because that's really what I'm interested in. Oh, it's really, really tight right now. Um, but... Um, that's probably why there is no reverse right now, but when I loosen it up, it probably will be a little bit better But I'll have to see how this puzzle ends up because right now it's just pretty eh, it's okay right now So the next puzzle we have here is the new Kung Fu 2x2 Now I actually have the Kung Fu 3x3 and 4x4 They were sent to me as the new island puzzles, but they're the same thing as the Kung Fu branded cubes So I wanted the 2x2 to complete the collection and I got it in stickerless Alright, so this is a pretty cheap 2x2, two two, and I'm really excited to see how it turns. So, um, let's just do some first turns. It's really, really fast, and it turns really nicely. This reminds me a lot of, like, the Chi 2x2, two two, like the original Chi stickerless 2x2. Two two. I actually have that right here. It actually turns exactly like that. It feels exactly the same. It actually is a little bit faster though, and it seems to be a little bit smoother as well, but I actually really like this. Um, I don't know if it'll be a main, but it does turn very nicely, and it'd be a pretty good 2x2 two two for a beginner. Corner cutting is really good, um, so yeah, pretty good puzzle overall. The next puzzle we have, or actually next two puzzles we have, are two mini Shangxiao 5x5s. I wanted two mini ones for something that I'll explain in the future, but um, I'm just going to open... Well, actually, we'll open both of them with my as well. And um, these are just two mini Shangxiao 5x5s. And they're pretty cool looking. They're about the same size as a 3x3. And um, let's just do some first turns. This is actually really weird to turn also. Well, it turns really nicely. It turns just like the other Shangxiao, or regular Shangxiao 5x5. Um... They're very luby right now, as all Shangxiao puzzles are, but um, yeah, they turn really nicely and they're a really interesting size. That's basically all I have to say. Pretty nice puzzles. The next puzzle we have here is the YJ uh, House Cube. Now, I just wanted this because I have like all of these differently shaped puzzles that are like the colored plastic. So I wanted to get the House Cube just to keep the collection going. Um, it has a chimney here and let's just do some first turns. It's a little bit stiff right now, but it's because the tensions are really tight, but um, I'm pretty sure this will be a pretty easy puzzle to solve, considering that you can turn it 180 degrees on this side, and it's still solved. But it turns very nicely, I like how this puzzle looks, and it's a pretty cool little puzzle. And then the last puzzle I got is a new Chi Square One, or uh, Pyraminx, I don't know why I said Square One. 
Um, I got a new Chi Square One because I traded mine away at uh, Slow and Steady for a way long uh, version one, so I just wanted a new one. And I'm actually really happy. This feels just like my other one did. Um, it's a little bit locky right now just because the tensions are a little bit tight. But um, actually, it's pretty nice, and it's just a regular Chi Pyramid, and I really like it. So that's about it for this unboxing from SpeedCubeShop.com. Big thanks to them for sending me these puzzles to test out, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment what you want to see next on my channel, and as always, thank you guys for watching. Bye.